The Hare Krishna movement has the best food in the world because it is offered to the Lord. You probably have heard that our Hare Krishna movement is very famous for their vegetarian cuisine. There even is a saying that we eat our way back to Godhead. What is special about it is that we turn the whole process into spiritual practice by offering every meal to the Lord first. In this way it becomes prasadam, food offered to Krishna. Now it is prasad. I will show you the best places from where we can get prasad. And when we eat prasadam, we make spiritual advancement. Today we want to show you our favorite places in Mayapur where you can get prasadam. It was a big sacrifice to go to all these restaurants and pizzerias to fill our bellies. But definitely worth it. You can easily find all the locations mentioned in the video on Google Maps. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. It would mean a lot to us. And we will start at the Govindas restaurant. It's in the center of the ISKCON campus and you can find all kinds of wonderful cuisine in here. Very nice food stuffs like pasta, tallies, anything you like. I hope you enjoy it. Gita Bhavan, Zulab Kitchen and Gada Bhavan are different prasadam halls. They are located in ISKCON campus and in this prasadam halls you can eat as much as you like. And in the moment we're in the line for Gada Bhavan lunch prasad. Don't be afraid of very big lines. They have a very sufficient system and these lines move very, very fast forward. So your waiting time will be minimized. I'm in. This prasad is wonderful and an experience for itself. <laughs> Here we are at Maha Stand. It is inside ISKCON campus and a very busy place. A lot of tourists come here in the morning to get their morning snack. Or you can come here for lunch and have a wonderful Maha Prashad Thali. Cheese dosha. You like cheese dosha? Look inside here, there's like a light. Here we are right in front of Prabhupada Samadhi and right opposite you have two wonderful options for a snack. The one option is Madhu Bakery and the other option is Karuna Kitchen. And doing you enjoy your snack, you can in the evening, on Saturday evenings, even look at the wonderful Hati procession. Our kids 
especially like in the Madhu Bakery, the paratas. They have a wonderful variety of paratas, but you can find here all kinds of snacks and um, treats. Bamanas. They have uh, tali, barata, butter chapati. This is your shop? Your shop? No? Here we are in one of the best bakeries in the world. It's the Seven Grain Bakery in Shrida, Mayapur. I would say it's the best bakery in the world, not one of the best bakeries in the world. Here we are in Sri Ranga's restaurant. It's a South Indian restaurant and the family came from South India to serve here very sweetly, very nice. Um, the community of Sri Dal Mayapur with their delicious South Indian preparations. Best dosha, best coconut sauce, and all cooked in ghee. Very, very, very delicious. Hare Krishna. Here we are in front of Anadan complex. Usually here in this complex, you get free meals. They're distributing 500 free meals per day and you can collect the coupon usually at 6 a.m. in the Radha Temple Courtyard. We want to make a video where, where you can eat in Mayapur. Today's lunch will be served by Goranga Garden Restaurant. It's a very nice, simple restaurant near Mayapur Hospital. Typical Indian cuisine. Wait, wait, wait. I want to take rice and dal. Do we 
have this or this or this sample. No, this is. I can describe it. One chowmin, hakka mm. chowmin, and mm. special thali, and, mm. and paneer butter masala. Mm. Okay. Anything more? Uh, the chapati is making. Yes. Thank you. Here we are in front of Shanti Cafe and as the name says, it is a very peaceful Shanti place where you can end your day in a comfortable atmosphere. We love to have good prasadam combined with good association. In Shrida Mayapur, you can find both easily. And for you, no more pizza the next month, just fruits. Why?